My name is Josiah Holmes. I've been coming to the Ridge about seven or eight years, and uh, I've been in students for about two years now. Something that really got me motivated into the church was just being in Ridge Kids. Like, Ridge Kids was just really fun to me. Like, I liked working with the kids. I like to hear what they have to say, and I love teaching them new things. I'm not much of a gamer, but I was looking for something that's just like kind of fun and out there that I could spend um, time with my friends with. Um, so Fortnite ended up just being it. Like it ended up being really fun. Like I could talk to my friends. We work on a plan to get the win, you know. My friend Xavier, uh, I did know him since K4 actually, but um, after I think first grade, we lost touch. A couple years later, a lot of years later, uh, we met at his aunt's wedding. With Xavier, I really didn't, I felt like I didn't really know the new him, you know? So um, I thought like it was pretty cool that, you know, I knew him before, you know, Xavier Jones. So I was like, hey, you wanna play Fortnite? Just give me your gamer tag. I could type it in and we could just play whatever. And he was like, yeah, cool. So then we just did that and we just been playing, I guess, ever since. I know he's going through some stuff, you know, and you know, he he need he needs something, you know, and I really didn't know what that something was. I just wanted to help him and I just wanted to be there for him, you know, just be a friend, you know. I didn't think we were going to be best friends like we are now, but something that I did do over the game when we were talking over the game was uh, we eventually got to that point of talking about, you know, stuff in our life, stuff going on in our life and I invited him here and I invited him to Ridge students and um, I could tell when he was here he really and me too we both we both just grew and I could feel both of our faith moving and even over the game we used to have conversations like that we would just talk about that like bro Ridge students was so amazing this week I liked when John was talking about that I like when I like that one scripture that really spoke to me you know stuff like that thinking back when I um, invited him it was it was kind of it was kind of scary mainly because I didn't know like you know him about him going to church I think I remember him saying he's never really been in the church scene before but um, I told him about rich students and I told him that you know it's a place that you know all teenagers are you know we could just hang out and everything's safe here you know and it it was it was a little scary I didn't know what he was gonna say or if he just generally just said no or if he just got offended I I didn't know what to think personally for me seeing him come here it feels very rewarding it feels very rewarding just knowing that I took that risk and invited him here and now he's been coming here he's been coming here he's been learning he's been increasing his spiritual journey I don't want to force him but I just told him what he could get out of it you know I just I just told him what he could get out of it what could happen I, it, I think it's worth it to take that risk because it could just change somebody's life for the better it can help them with their spiritual journey or even begin their spiritual journey or pick back up their spiritual journey. If you really care about somebody in your life or a friend or a family member or just somebody, I don't know, you see going through something, I'd say with that risk, there always is that risk, but if you really see them struggling and you think this can help them, just present it to them. Show them what could come from this.